Hey everyone, welcome back. For those of you who are new here, my name is Melody. I'm back at Aldi and they have this boot, shoe, and glove dryer. This is only $9.99 now. It was $15. They've also got this seagrass bathroom decor here. Or that's how they're describing it. It's $9 now, down from $13. And it looks like... Is that a three-piece set, or is it? I cannot tell. Okay, so that's individual. So this is, I believe this is $9, and then this is $9. Or, oh, okay, or they've got items like this. Here's another find, a really good one too, by the way. $4.49 down from 10 and it's a three-piece bathroom set. I only see them in black though, at least at this location. The um, barista coffee towels are $1.59 now. They um, just came out a few weeks ago. Here's some of the other designs. It looks like they've got quite a few of them. This warming pottery mug is $2.50, down from $5. Look at this. This is $40 and it is a pet bed. Isn't that adorable? For $10, you can grab this pet food container. Actually comes with a scoop. Oops. And then, okay, and then that's the lid there. They've also got this interactive, um, Playtime puzzle, puzzle toy. It's definitely something I need for my dog. These guided journals. These are now $2.58. They've got multiple, multiple colors. I'm telling you guys, it really seems as though they've got a lot more items in, like, stuff isn't selling if that makes sense like they're marking stuff down and they still have plenty of it left twenty dollars will get you this lap desk looks like it has a little container in there for a dollar 49 you can get a two-piece bamboo utensil and they've also got the spoon and slotted spoon version Seven dollars. You can get this set of two cutting boards, bamboo cutting boards. This is another item. It's four dollars and ninety-nine cents. Five dollars. I was actually eyeing this from the ad last week. Was it last week or the week before? And they have so many of them. I think I'm gonna wait. I I wanted it, but I want it in this beautiful amber color. They have so many, I get the feeling they're gonna be marking those down soon. Although, $5 for two isn't bad. Well, this is adorable. It's a Count and Learn cookie jar. We've got other versions too. And it's $15 now, down from $17. Hey everyone, I am now at Marshall's and I have to tell you guys, I made a mistake of going to Aldi on a Wednesday. <laughs> it was so busy. I tried to get some of the food, but um, it was just packed. So I just left and I came to Marshall's. I, I found these quaint little lamps here at Marshall's and it looks like they are rechargeable and portable LED table lamp. And there is a USB cord included. It's $15. That's nice if you wanted a lamp someplace where you can't, um, you know, you don't have a cord. They're actually kind of cute too, or nice looking I should say. I like this one. Also got these 
mushrooms that light up. Isn't that neat? How much is this? Let's see here. Not sure if you can see that. This is $15. I really like this frosted glass one back here. That one is $15 as well. And they've also got these mushrooms here. These are $8. It's got the wood base and like a crushed velvet or a velvet top. Oh my goodness, do you guys see this? This is really nice. Look at this. This is $70 for the two-piece set. Wow, I really like that. You guys, it has a 10-year warranty. also got two other matching pieces 90 for this one and 100 for the larger one now and not too much is really new here so far looks like they've just started to put out some more Easter and as you can see here the shelf is empty and over here as well just trying to keep my eye out for anything that I think might be new or interesting to you guys This is nice. Got these multi-purpose cleaning wipes here. You get 160 in there. Curious, I wonder 
Oh, here we go. Here's the active ingredient. Interesting. I'm telling you, I really am not seeing anything to, or anything popping out at me that seems new or exciting, which is kind of a bummer. Because I'm seeing people find all kinds of fun stuff. And of course, I can't remember what those items are now because I'm here at the store. Let's see. Well, they've got some Christmas socks. <laughs> they, must, they must have found a box of them in the back. Plenty of gloves. Got some umbrellas here manual open ones. I see black and navy. Still have just the few chickens I found along with the Halloween. Some St. Patrick's Day decor and uh, costumes. Oh, this is cute. Pack of 12 mustaches. Got the scrunchy brand headbands here. There's another version. These are pretty headbands in the pastel colors. You get six of them. Oh, these are nice as well. Got the hair scrunchy with the little ribbon at the bottom. It's like they've got peach and cream. These are pretty. Oh, I love this. Got the little clip. They've even got a smaller version with two in there. Got the bobby pins with butterflies. And these headbands are cute with the little bees on the back. All right, now how about this claw clip? That's huge, I love it. Oh, look at these, oh my goodness. Here's a pretty hair clip or barrette. They have one in black as well. They've got some more scrunchy brand hair bands. They've also got this version, this version. And this one here. I also found some scrunchy brand hair barrettes and you get two in this package or on this package. So I found this hair scrunchie. It's by Sophie. That's pretty. Feels like it's pretty good quality too. Look at this. I found this table mirror here. Oops. There we go. Over in the baby section, I found this. It's 40% zinc oxide by Playtex Baby. And um, it has a pretty good date on it of 12-4-2026. This is a really good find if you can get that. It's 2.5 ounces. Well, look what I found. Snickers cookie dough, and you know I'm getting that. They've even got the Butterfingers. I used to love these with buttered popcorn at the movies. It was such a delicious combo. I mean, very unhealthy, but super delicious. Did you guys know they made Junior Caramels? I had no idea, but apparently they're new and improved and they look really delicious. Oh, no way. You guys, I also found Twix cookie dough.
I think I need to get out of this aisle. I, again, came hungry because I'm very bad about eating before I go shopping. <laughs> Everything looks good to me. Does anyone else do that? The thing is, I'm tr in such a rush to get out of the house before the crowds get in the stores that I just can't um, force myself to eat something. <laughs> I'm just wanting to get it done. Because let me tell you, once you get out you get out past noon, that's when the crowds are just a little too much for me. They have the Oreo Cakesters. Now I know this isn't new here. I almost bought one one time, but the, the man at the, or the gentleman at the checkout, I told him, I said, they look super moist and delicious. And he said, they're not really that moist. They're more on the dry side. So just a heads up, unless he had a bad one got lentils here as well along with some brown rice oh is that a three dollar item that can't be right that's the only one with a sticker on it and actually this one has a hole in it i better tell someone about that let's see they have millie's sipping broth here i don't know who millie is but she looks like a nice lady you get three steepable broth bags. These are $1.75 now, guys. All right, everyone, I'm actually back from shopping. I thought I'd start with Aldi first since that's where I bought the most stuff. I picked up a plain old avocado, some poblano peppers, onions, I did pick up these dental chews for my dog. Um, it's a four pack for $5. I think that was $5, yeah. Now that I'm thinking about it, probably not the best deal. Okay, one moment, Yugi. I did pick up these brioche buns. I also grabbed the love seat cover and sofa cover. I measured and I think that they will fit my my husband's, re I think this will fit my husband's recliner and I think this will fit my sofa, hopefully. Either way, they were both around, let's see, let me look at the receipt. This was $14.99, $15 and the sofa cover was $17.99, $18. I felt for that price, it was a really good buy. So hopefully this will help me to keep the scratches off of my sofa and chair. I did pick up three bags of this basmati rice. I grabbed three cans of the albacore tuna. And last but not least, I did pick up this playtime puzzle toy for my dog. I'm hoping that this will help her. She's kind of strange when she eats. I'm sorry, but you are. I'm sorry. I'm just telling it like it is. So, <laughs> she's very, okay, that's enough. She's Okay, she's, she's not happy that I'm talking about her apparently. But I think that this will help her because she likes to hunt for her food. I know that sounds weird. But she likes it when she has to like look for it. And um, she'll, she'll even take her food out of the bowl and then chase it and play with it. It's kind of funny. Next up are the items I picked up from Dollar Tree and from Marshall's. From Dollar Tree, I did grab the Snickers cookie dough the Butterfingers, and I did pick up the Twix cookie dough as well, along with this diaper rash cream, which actually comes in very handy. And for $1.25, that is a good buy. I also grabbed a pair of tongs because I've been needing a new pair, and I didn't want to spend too much on them because after a while, the spring starts to rust and they, they just go bad pretty quickly. From Marshalls, I did buy some more of these microfiber towels. It was $7 for 12. I bought a pack of these a few weeks ago and I absolutely love them, so I grabbed more. I did buy two of these pigs for my dog. She's chewed up the one I purchased for her a few weeks ago, and so I thought I'd go ahead and pick her up a couple more. I did buy this Chuck It Ball for $3. It was on clearance. Let's see if we can find out how much it originally was. It was originally $5.99 and I, I picked it up for $3. And I also picked up this dog toy for her. I thought that she'd have fun with it because it's kind of long and floppy. This was also $6. Oh, the pigs were $6 as well. I forgot to mention that. 
And he's got this little guy. He's got squeakers in all of his paws. And that's it. That's everything I bought. Thank you everyone so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do enjoy this type of content, please consider subscribing. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.